What is nutrition? Nutrition is everything you eat and drink. You need a variety of nutrients to keep your body working well. The basic nutrients are carbohydrates, proteins, fats, vitamins, and minerals. These are broken down and used throughout the body. Each food contains different nutrients. Each nutrient helps the body to work properly. Eating well will help you feel good and stay healthy. The good news is that you are in charge of what you eat and how much you eat. How well are you eating? Are you getting all the nutrients you need for good health? A healthy diet means you choose foods that have the right balance of nutrients. Choosing foods high in sugar, fat, and salt can lead to weight gain. Without the right nutrients, you may feel tired and run down. Poor nutrition can lead to diseases like diabetes, cancer, or heart disease. For more information on how to make better food choices, go to www.choosemyplate.gov. You will learn how to build a healthy meal. Fill half of your plate with vegetables, like salad, broccoli, tomatoes, or carrots. The brighter the color, the more nutrients. For dessert, choose a fresh fruit or fruit candidate's own juice. One fourth of your plate is for lean cuts of meat, chicken, or fish. These provide protein. A proper portion of meat is about the size of a deck of cards. Plant sources of protein include beans, nuts, and seeds. The remaining fourth of your plate is for a starch or carbohydrate. This could be rice, pasta, bread, or potatoes. Try to choose whole grain pasta, bread, or brown rice. These provide more fiber than plain white bread, pasta, or rice. Sweet potatoes or yams provide more nutrients and fiber than a white potato. Just be careful not to add extra sugar or a lot of butter. A touch of cinnamon can add taste. Dairy products like milk and yogurt provide carbohydrates, protein, and varying amounts of fat. It is best to choose low-fat milk and yogurt. Watch out for added sugar in yogurt. Foods you should eat less often are ones high in fat, sugar, and salt. These include foods such as cookies, candy, ice cream, chips, and soda. Limit your intake of fatty meats, like ribs, bacon, sausage, and hot dogs. Keep in mind what my plate looks like. It will help you make better choices about what and how much to put on your plate. Today, most people want to improve how they eat. Whether at home or eating out, they want to make healthier choices. Some restaurants now list calories. There can be a big difference between a supersize or regular burger. Most fast food places allow you to choose a salad instead of fries. And kids' meals offer fruit instead of cookies. When buying foods for home use, all packaged foods must have a food nutrition label. A food label is important. It must list the different nutrients that are in the food. It also tells you the amount of fat, salt, sugar, and calories per serving size. It can help you make good food choices. Let's look at some of the nutrients that are listed. Carbohydrates or carbs. Carbohydrates provide your body with energy. Carbohydrates have varying amounts of fiber, sugar, and starch. Some carbs may not have any fiber, but lots of sugar. Other carbs can be mostly starch. The label lists the total grams of carbs per serving. The label must further list how much of the total is from fiber and sugar. The more fiber and the less sugar, the better it is for you. A serving of carbohydrates is 15 grams. A slice of bread has about 15 grams of carbohydrates. A small apple is about 15 grams. And a cup of milk has about 15 grams of carbohydrates. Most people should choose three to four servings of carbohydrates per meal. This would be about 45 to 60 grams of carbohydrates per meal. Simple carbohydrates give your body quick energy. They usually taste sweet. Fruits are a healthy choice because they are naturally sweet. A cup of fresh fruit is a serving size. Read the label on canned fruits or juices. Limit foods with added sugar like cakes, pies, cookies, and candy. These add extra calories, but no extra nutrients. Complex carbohydrates give you energy that lasts longer. These include breads, cereals, rice, pasta, and starchy vegetables. Choose breads and cereals that say whole grain because they have more fiber. Proteins. 
Proteins help the body build and repair muscle, skin, and bone. All animal products contain protein. Good proteins are lean meat and pork, skinless chicken and turkey, and seafood. Try to limit fatty meats, such as ribs, bacon, sausage, and deli meats. Milk, yogurt, cheese, and eggs are good sources of protein. Plant sources of protein are nuts, seeds, beans, and soy products. Fats. Fats are in both plant and animal foods. They provide energy and keep your skin and hair healthy. Fats also help your body absorb some vitamins. Some fats may protect your heart, while others may increase the risk of heart disease or cancer. Most people eat too much fat or the wrong type of fat. There are different types of fats. Saturated fats are usually solid. Eating too much of these may increase the risk of heart disease. Saturated fat is in whole milk, butter, cheese, and ice cream. It is also in fatty meats, like bacon and sausage. Unsaturated fats are usually liquid. These fats are healthier for you. Good sources are canola oil, olive oil, corn oil, soybean oil, salmon, and nuts. One type of fat to avoid is trans fat. Use the label to help choose foods lower in saturated fat and avoid foods with trans fat. Fiber. Fiber helps foods move through your body. Fiber helps lower cholesterol. Fiber helps reduce the risk of many chronic diseases. Fiber helps you feel full so you do not overeat. Most people do not eat enough fiber. Try to get about 30 grams of fiber each day. It is listed on the food label under total carbohydrates. Look for high fiber cereals and whole grain breads. Fruits, vegetables, and beans are also great sources of fiber. Vitamins. There are many different vitamins. They help your body work properly and keep you from getting sick. Some vitamins keep your skin, nails, and hair healthy. Vitamin A helps your eyesight, especially at night. The B vitamins are important for healthy nerves. Vitamin C keeps your gums healthy and helps fight colds. Vitamin D builds strong bones and teeth. The best source of vitamins comes from eating a healthy diet. Plan to eat a variety of different foods. If you do not get enough vitamins, you may feel tired or develop infections. Talk to your doctor before taking any vitamin pills. Calcium. Calcium is important throughout the body. Calcium helps your heart and muscles work smoothly. Calcium makes strong bones and teeth. Choose two to three servings each day of calcium-rich foods, such as milk, yogurt, and cheese. Iron. Iron is important to make healthy red blood cells. They carry oxygen to all parts of your body. Iron helps you have energy. A lack of iron can cause anemia or a low hemoglobin level. Iron is in red meats, dried beans, eggs, salmon, tuna, spinach, and dark leafy greens. Sodium. Sodium is another word for salt. Most people eat too much salt. This can cause high blood pressure. Most foods naturally contain sodium. Many packaged foods have added salt. Salty chips, fast foods, Frozen and canned foods have sodium. We only need 2,300 milligrams of sodium per day. This is the amount in one teaspoon of salt. Since so many foods already contain sodium, it is not necessary to add salt to your food. Food Labels This diagram is from the Staying Healthy book developed by the Florida Literacy Coalition on page 61. The label is from a package of macaroni and cheese the colors and numbers will help as you read the food label. Does this packaged food have any trans fat? Does this packaged food have a lot of sodium? Would this be a healthy food to eat? A food label tells you the size of one serving. It also tells you how many servings are in the package. The food label lists the calories, fat, sugar, and salt that are in one serving.